Hello, one and all. This is One of Tacos. Welcome back to Let's Play Blood. Fresh Supply. When me last left off, I know I say this quite a bit, but I do not like this level. Welcome to In the Flesh. What, to some people, is one of the most memorable levels in this game. And to me, it's also pretty damn memorable, but for all the wrong reasons. This level is gross, it is disgust, and it is worse than those things. It is one wretched maze. This level is one of those levels that makes the maze levels in Doom look like a kid's challenge. I have had to look up guides to get through this damn level before. I don't know if I have to do that again. Time may have made me better, or it may have made me worse. But we're gonna try to make it through it. It's not the it's not necessarily the grossness of this level that disturbs me. The whole fact that it that it's taking place in like some living fleshy being. It's not that. Did I kill the gargoyles? Good, I did. I had to load there. It's not it's not that. It's just that in this game, that kind of thing is taken to an absolute ex extreme. I heard that I upset a oh, hellhound. There's one. He's going running off that distance. The other hell um, probably did something similar. Eventually they're gonna wind up on the elevator. I just kinda have to deal with it. With this many of them running around the place, I'm gonna get burnt. There goes my fire armor, but I'm still above on health. This is the area we could have fallen into. As you can see, the gargoyle is still flying up around there. I actually want that. That is basic armor. When I said I was almost out of fire armor, I lied. I'm, it's the blue armor I'm almost out of. Hey, guys! The use of this many flying at, uh, flying monsters in a level of this design is a bit of a false design choice, I would say. There he is, and he got a good licking on me. But he dropped a life seed, so all's fair, I suppose. Pick up lots of Tesla ammo. We'll actually put his back up to maximum Tesla ammo. There's that. As you can see, instead of music, this level opts in for ugly, squishy noises. Because again, in case you have not understood the motif of this level yet, it's fleshy. As if we are were in something. It's disgusting. And the frame rate is having trouble staying stable. For those of you who do not watch the thief videos. Oh hey, Chief. Two chiefs. Anyways, for those of you who do not watch the thief videos, um, I believe the issue with the frame rate is due to um, one of the hard drives on my computer getting ready to go out again. I'm going to be here all day doing this. And he actually got a lick in on me. Stabbing the walls makes him bleed, which is kind of cute. 
Where is my Tesla gun? There we are. It's fine. Two licks? No. Not so fine. We'll get through this. Problem is, I can't really back up. I guess I can. Well, that was brilliantly done, and I'm gonna step out of his way before he actually manages to get one of those attacks through the bars. I don't know if we can open these by simply approaching them and pressing enter. I'm not going to try until these two are dead. Anyways, I believe the frame rate issue is due to one of my hard drives going out. It typically is. It's been a while since I've lost a hard drive, so it does seem to be about that time. Unfortunately, uh, there's nothing I can do about it. I don't have the money to take the computer into a shop right now, let alone the money to buy another hard drive. I hate to sound so grim about it, but uh, to state it matter-of-factly, if one of my hard drives goes out, uh, the video recording will just come to a halt for a while. Not forever. Not forever. But until I can get a new hard drive. Technique. I don't know if these are hitting him. That seems like a lot of wasted ammo. Like, when it took, like, close to 50 to drop the first guy, because we have 250 max and we're at 192. I think you've got to be, like, right in bars for it to go through. Come on down, big guy. Ugh. I wish he'd stop connecting with those hits. You know what? Anything to stall getting through this level. <laughs> If I can make a 20 minute video of killing this guy over and over again, I will! Come on! Come on! Fly on down! Stop hitting me! You get one! There! I'm taking it! It's done! You don't have to watch me do that anymore. I promise. I'd love for you guys to come down. Ow! <laughs> well played, Gargoyle. That is the wrong weapon. That's fine. Oh, I actually got him. Not every day that actually gets him. There. I got plenty of napalm launcher ammo. Let's just get used. Can I open this? No. Gonna have to be something else that opens that. Ah, this level is disgusting. This is a secret, apparently. Well, if we're not going that way, where are we going? We must be going this way. Nope, we're not going that way either. We have already begun getting lost. And I'm not taking that fall damage because I don't have to. Ah! No! This way! I have no idea what I did by shooting that. Other than start the chanting. Ooh, there's more Tesla ammo. Perhaps I've opened this. No, I have not. Did it close? It might have closed. Hard to tell. Can't tell, honestly. Well. We've now jumped through what is probably some thing's rib cage.
Thank you for using those game. I really appreciate that enemy type. That is my favorite enemy type. If there's a way to activate that again, I don't know it. Shotgun shells. What I'm sure is going to be enemies up there. Don't see any. Oh, hello! I can deal with that better. Oh, that's water! I thought that would be like burning acid. That missed. And this area here is stable enough to walk on. I'd rather not pick a swim if I don't have to. Well, that opened this. Revealing more of my favorite enemy in the game. Ah, you too. Sometimes all a man can do is just sigh. Unless we have opened something else with our actions, we might have to go down into that pond. <laughs> I'm just so happy to be here right now. Yeah, I think we're getting into the water. Believe me, I don't want to. But it looks like I'm not currently blessed with options. What I can do is rain fiery hell down upon it, though. There's a lot of freaky fishmen down there. One of them got a bite on me. You know what? One bite is acceptable. We still have that other life scene. Let's not forget. I actually don't like that, though. As much as it might seem a waste, these are another enemy type that it's really good to just try to just try to hit with the maple launcher. Because trying to fight these guys in their own turf like this is an effort and futility. I'm surprised I actually got that quote off right the first time. Well, we're now here. That looks like it would be something different, but it isn't. We are rewarded with another napalm launcher. This is down here. What it doesn't seem to be anything worth looking at. I actually want to come up here for air. And because we're going this way in general. Ouch, you betcha! Why would you do that? Why? Damn you! I have no idea what that opened. Oh, it opened this. Oh goody, I get to get crushed. Because living organisms have crushing things inside their, themselves, don't you know? I thought I saw something devilish. 
The frame rate dip when fighting those guys is not beneficial. I do not believe that is the end of the level. Bull! Okay, that was the end of the level. Is there not another one that goes like this? I have awaited you. Why did you cast us down? How did we fail you? You were always loyal to me. You most of all, my child. Then why? Then why? Because I knew you would return. Can you not see? Every life that you have taken has made you stronger. And you have returned to me with a greater sacrifice than I ever could have wished. With the power you bring, I shall throw open the door between the worlds and inherit the Earth. Hmm. Is that so? Come to me, my son. Let us embrace at last. Fool, you are already dead. I remember that level being a lot longer than that, but that's probably because I didn't like that level very much. When you don't like something, it seems to go on longer, that's for sure. Alright, we are now on the final level of what is originally the last episode. This guy is a doozy. I remember this fight being tough. I probably should have backtracked. You know what? Yeah. As much as I hate being back here for any reason whatsoever. I can't actually backtrack and grab that life seed. And that would be a smart decision. Not going this way, mind you, but... That way I can start the next level with with what is supposed to be near 200% health. I'm not loading for that. Oh well. Poor unstable frame rate. It's not getting... Nope, nope, I'm getting crushed. Okay, so I gotta do this again. I thought I would be smart enough not to get crushed on the way back, but apparently I'm not smart enough to not get crushed on the way back. Well, it just means this time I can get the life seed without putting my life in so much peril. And yet I ended up going this way again. It's probably because it is the fastest way. I need to go right here. Let's wait for it to come back up because this apparently found a way to hurt me. It doesn't matter if we fall here. In fact, let's fall voluntarily. Even that poor cutscene was at a lower frame rate than what it should have been. But this way, I'll have 200% health. And we'll skip that. Fool, you are already dead. And we'll come here, and we will save. As... Nope, 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 nope. Save 45 here. And I am going to go ahead and call the video just a little bit early because this is the final boss of the first level and we're not going to get very far with a minute standing. So, thank you all for watching and when we come back, the final boss of the game, at least before the expansions came out. I'll see you later. Thanks for watching and I'm glad we're through that flesh level. See you later. Bye-bye.